Cardiovascular disease is the leading cause of death. Most of the heart attacks are due to the gradual process of atherosclerosis. However, this disease very rarely causes any symptoms. Since heart attack can be treated very effectively, one of the main problems to treat is that the patient misjudge their situation and seek help too late, especially in the case of a heart attack. For example, in 2019, more women died from an ischemic heart disease than from breast cancer in Germany. With this example in mind, there is a diagnostic gap with heart diseases. Most of the patients with heart diseases are very asymptomatic and with minimal heart symptoms. Typically, when the disease is far advanced, life-threatening problems occur such as heart attack. Such heart attacks are very sudden and of without warning. The affected heart is always, in most of the cases, is already deceased. It's just that the patient didn't feel it. Doctors have had a few technological options to predict the heart disease in a very asymptomatic stage. Old techniques such as ECG or exercise ECG are of very limited to predict the relevant circulatory disorder. Most helpful technologies in this area such as CTs or MRIs are too expensive and complex to be used prophylactically. This is now changing with cardiography as a decision-making aid for an early diagnostic phase. This was specially developed to detect a heart attack at a very early stage that would not be discoverable in unconventional ECG examinations. The great potential of cardiography lies in an early detection of patients who are still asymptomatic and whose health status does not warrant to determine a cardiovascular status. In the future, our technology is primed to tell you exactly the details, for example, what specific illness are we dealing with and what area of the heart is affected. For example, today we can tell you that the artery is occluded and tomorrow we won't be able to tell you that the left main artery is narrowing around 70%. Through our experience and research around cardiography, we have found that the signals from vector cardiography can be attributed to treat specific illness. This is something that we wanted to research further and ultimately make it available to all the patients. As a result, heart diseases could be found very early and treated very precisely. As a matter of fact, many physicians using our technology have indicated that this solution would be a true game changer. In the future, we won't be able to identify heart diseases at a very early stage. The diagnostic paths or time that would take someone to be diagnosed with the disease would be shortened. These treatments are very effective and less expensive. After all, cardiography is a very simple method and can be used everywhere.
This is a fantastic opportunity that can be used in most of the rural areas who lack access to diagnostic equipments such as MRIs and CTs.